Mors Principium Est. Try saying that five times fast. <laughs> Greetings, hard and heavy music fans. I'm Dante, this is The Heavy Haystack, and today I'm talking about the new album from Morse Principium S titled Seven. Seven is unsurprisingly the seventh album from Finnish melodic death metal band Morse Principium Est. And this band has been around for a while, since 1999 in fact, and have a pretty sizable fan base compared to other bands in the genre. But I've just discovered them for the first time with this new record, and they sound well worth talking about. MPE is a straight up melodic death metal band comparable to many of the genre's pioneers. They take the melodic guitar work and synth usage of bands like Dark Tranquility and Early in Flames and beef that up with at the gates level speed and intensity. It's a combination that's been done a whole lot of times but rarely gets done to this high of a level. The song I discovered them on called Lost in a Starless Aeon has some dizzying guitar work with sweet picking twin leads laid over some chuggy metal chorus rhythm playing. It also features a slightly slowed down chorus, maintaining the twin lead guitars at a mid-tempo, which provide the hook more so than the vocals do. It also has a simple yet pretty impressive guitar solo. All the parts flow easily from one to the next, and made a pretty strong first impression of the band to me. The Everlong Night is one of the best examples on the record of the band's use of symphonic elements to add some flavor. Orchestral string sections are played in tandem with the guitars and some of the bridges of the song that add an epic classical vibe and are most notable on the chorus sections of the song where the strings take the lead, while the guitars focus on spaced out chuggy rhythms with pauses to highlight the strings even further. Album Closer and currently most popular song from the album, My Home, My Grave, provides a lot of cinematic imagery. Beginning with an organ playing a dark gothic theme accompanied by a haunting vocal chorus, the song then goes to a string section, which then leads into a blast beat opening to kick the song off. The driving riff of the verses is a little bit stock, but it's effective, and sounds even more epic when it goes into the louder chorus. The song takes a lot of familiar elements of melodic European metal, including orchestration, and marries it all excellently within this song. Seven is an album that knows exactly what it is and exactly what it's going for. It's a melodic death metal album that's not interested in reinventing the wheel, but rather polish it to a mere finish. The album Seven by Morris Principium S gets a four out of five based purely on quality of execution of established musical ideas, and you'll be hard-pressed to find a better Mellow Death album in all of 2020. What did you think of the album? How does it compare to other Mellow Death albums that have been released in the year? Leave a like, comment, and subscribe to The Heavy Haystack if you want to see more videos similar to this one. Peace, love, music, and I'll see y'all next time.